all my videos start exactly the same. Good morning. 6.45 on Saturday, January 21st. We just woke up and we're gonna go do some cardio. And I'm gonna take you guys through a day in the life because today we are officially 14 weeks out. Oh. and then run off to work to take care of those clients. In between some clients, I'll have my ground turkey, rice, <laughs> spinach, and avocado oil meal, and I will save you guys the boredom of seeing that same meal literally again. Straight after work, we are going to be running over to Pierre to meet up with Kenny for a leg day. I'll see if he's good to film. I did film like our last few sessions, so I might wanna maybe taper off and give him a day off, but if Kenny's chill with the filming, we'll do the filming. I'll bring y'all along with me to just chill out the rest of the night. And in this vlog, I will also bring you along for my check-ins tomorrow, and I'll update y'all on the protocol for 14 weeks out. Why is that funny? That's not funny. We are T minus 10 minutes away from Pure. I texted Kenny. He said he's chill if I film. And he was happy that I uh, asked and gave him notice. Sorry, Kenny. I'm just shipping on a little rock star moment. <sighs> I talked about this one in my last vlog and it's actually quite delicious. Um. I do find that rock stars in general have more of a chemically taste, but we can ignore that because it's not six carb, it's one carb, and we can appreciate that about the rock star. Okay, enough jibber jabber. Let's go work out. Yeah, it's so bad, I wanna shoot, shoot, shoot like who. That's a wrap on my time at Pure. I also did some lying hamstring crawls 
Uh, some wide stance lunges, some abs also. That is the full spiel. I'm actually gonna just pull my car up just so I can park right in front and then run in and heat up some food in their microwave. Delish. Thank you, Kenny, for another literally killer session. If you guys are in like the GTA area or um, you've just really wanted to come work out at Pure but you have no idea what you're doing, I'm pretty sure Kenny is accepting some in-person clients for training. So here's his Instagram in case you didn't already know. Follow him, shoot him a DM. He's super fucking great. Couldn't say better things. I have never been stuck in traffic the way that I was just stuck in traffic. I've been driving for over an hour. My gas light went on maybe 20 kilometers ago. So we are pushing it. Like, struggle city. So we're gonna have to get some gas. Gas has been acquired. I really have to pee. <laughs> so if this car would go, that would be great because I, I don't know why we're stuck. We're uploading a video. Fine. Ah. Let's go eat some chicken and rice, baby. I make YouTube videos. I do make YouTube videos. Okay, gotcha. yeah. Just so I'm showing them my chicken and rice. I didn't get my steps in. Bitch, we're going on an adventure. We're gonna go get those steps in now. If you know, you know. We hit our 12,000 steps. Let's cook some shit. Um, tonight we'll just cook some rice and some ground beef because I feel certain that after tomorrow's check-in, those items probably will not disappear. talk about for one second this is not sponsored but they did send me this this brand called plant of life sent me their sleep CBD oil it's so good like the way that I am so relaxed and it just sets me up to just fall asleep so like seamlessly honestly I can't recommend it enough if you are having problems falling asleep I would definitely recommend this or if you just want to like zen out and like relax for a second another product that I use for sleep that's really good is sleep HD take three of these they're supposed to promote deep sleep uh, and help reduce inflammation and muscle soreness because Kenny kicked my ass today maybe I will uh, take three of these before bed tonight see y'all for check-ins morning it's 9 a.m. I just slept for 11 hours. Let's do our check-in and send it off to Kenny. We weighed in today at 145.9 and 20.3% fat bring y'all closer, show you some uh, check-in photos. The last thing I'm gonna do before I go and do cardio is make some predictions about what I think Kenny's gonna say. One of two things, either he's going to drop food a little bit more and tell me to fight a little, or he's gonna be really happy with how things progress this week. And we'll have one more week where we follow the same like guidelines. That would be the 400 calories every day on the stairs. And then that would be last week's plan where I eat high on training days and I eat low on rest days. Either way, whatever he decides to tell me is protocol for 
next week. I feel very proud of this check-in. I feel like I've worked this week and um, the results show. So yeah, let's go get very sweaty on the stairs. Cardio is really good today. <laughs> I think the extra sleep definitely gave me a little boost. It's 10.45, I haven't even had a meal yet which is fine because it's rest day and so rest day food is less food so that just means that my eating window is going to be shorter today so I'll probably feel more satiated throughout the day which is a win. Let's make some oats. It's one o'clock in the afternoon. I sat in the bathtub for like a solid 30 minutes. Uh -uh. It was so nice. I never get just like a full day off to just chill. So the fact that I get to just chill, do my regular stuff today, preach. We heard back from Kenny and he was happy. Forward, the only thing that's changing for this upcoming week is that cardio is now increased. So I was doing seven days a week at 400 cows. We're now going to be doing seven days a week at 500 cows. So if you thought I was getting up early before, um, ya bitch is getting up even earlier. Oh, I didn't talk about this earlier, but look how sick this sweater is. It is a black camo. One of my um, coach's friends over at pure this is his brand i actually filmed a little clip of him talking about his brand yesterday so i'm gonna play that for you now raw bodybuilding it's my brand it's an apparel brand and coaching services it's like a top quality brand i'm gonna let her give me her feedback later on uh, i just wanted to show her my support during her prep she's gonna be representing us remember the name raw bodybuilding we're gonna be having new designs in the coming couple of months stay tuned so anyways feel free to check out uh raw bodybuilding he told me he was bringing me a hoodie he was like what size do you want i was like obviously extra large if you see me living in this hoodie for the rest of prep that's where it's from he also got me one in camo green <sighs> okay we have a ground turkey meal right now and the ground turkey do not be cooked, so let's go cook it. I called one of my best friends this morning when I was on the stairs. Oh, come on, focus. And I asked her if she wanted to go to the grocery store with me today, and she said she was down. One of my best friends, Bianca, I'm gonna go pick her up. She's going to come with me to Walmart. Hello. Want to be in the vlog? Sure. <laughs> oh, you just sat on something. What? Oh. So Amanda came to my house on Thursday after work so we could have a little friend sesh hangout. And she put her jacket on my bed frame thing. And when she, this guy was sitting on top of it, and when she took her jacket, <laughs> somehow she drove all the way home with this in her hood. <laughs> the back of her hood and put it in her house and then lifted it up and that's just an octopus my octopus and he's not happy no he's not happy because men are terrible that is facts <laughs> all right we're gonna go to walmart bye okay what is going on these bananas are on freaking steroids those are massive this is my hand it's twice the size of my hand just kidding. They have bags. We're gonna get a bag. I cannot think straight right now. I feel um yeah, definitely overstimulated, but also like I don't know, my brain feels fried. What's going on guys? This is Sean Trainer, just chilling with AJ Lifts. Just going grocery shopping, you know what I mean? You just buy them. Welcome to my city where you always run into somebody you know. This is a real one though. We're choosy about corn over here. No, Nick it, no. Oh, her brother is choosy about corn. Can somebody tell me if they've tried these? 
And if they're any good, because I'm kind of debating it. How many bags did you bring? Zero. Bye, Bianca. We love you. Bye. Grocery haul. Red potatoes, frozen blueberries, lotion for my dry ass hands, some chicken, some nanners, got two different kinds of tea, vanilla, boy boys. Someone's gonna fucking give it to me in the comments. Robust, I don't know. Cinnamon apple spice. Got some English cucumbers, arugula for salads, spring mix for salads, and romaine lettuce. So we're gonna have to clean this guy. I'm gonna cook some potatoes and some chicken, and I'm gonna make a tea. I'm gonna make a vanilla whatever tea. Sherbert is here. ITC Nutrition, they're so good. Uh, it is 5.30 on the clock. I've hit about 9k steps today, so I do have another 3k steps to hit at some point, but right now it is like freezing rain outside, which is pretty gross. So let's check the weather. Okay, fun. It's gonna clear up later around like eight and my mom and my dad both love to walk. So maybe I can talk one of them into a little stroll. Today's food would have followed the same protocol as my rest day food, which is low carb. So I had uh, 50 grams of rice in my ground turkey meal. And then I had about 70 grams of red potato in my beef meal. And that sort of wraps up my carbs for the day. So the last two meals I'll eat today will just be chicken, oil, asparagus, one meal. Second meal will be flank steak and salad. I did just spend like two hours cooking and prepping. I thought I only had to make chicken and potatoes and then I realized that I didn't have enough rice and then I had to make salmon and then I needed asparagus. So I just stopped filming and I just started grinding crap out but I really just feel like chilling out right now so probably gonna start editing this vlog that you're watching now drink my rainbow sherbet um and yeah that's it if for any reason you made it this far into the video thanks love you feel free to subscribe like and give me a little comment if you want to be a part of the secret comment club leave a comment telling me what you would name a pet turtle if you had a pet turtle so random i don't know y'all it's a low carb day she's a little bit cracked out whatever anyways thanks love y'all catch you later